Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. How are you doing today? How is everybody? Alrighty, here we are. Green Raptor, hello again, noob. Hey buddy, how are you doing, man? Thanks for joining in so quick. <laughs> I'm Rushi Gaming, start quick. What, you in a hurry or something? <laughs> Okie dokie, where are we? Uh, Pim there, done that. And today we have the last two, so we'll finish it off. So, let's see what are the opponents like. What are the nodes that I need. Mutant. Biohazards or bleed immunes. And for the boss, let's take Human Torch and we should be good. Oops, hopefully I'm not disconnected. Okay, hey man, hope you're doing good. I am very good, Horizon. How are you? Just starting off... Exploration on Thronebreaker 1.2 and 1.1 and after we will do some Battlegrounds. Oops, SP2. Well, that's a bad start. That's a bad start. Stonebreaker feels like Defender on steroids. No, this time around, they have been much better. Last time, they were bad. These times, they are much better. Bro, I'm working on 8.1 exploration using MCOC. New... Hacks and videos. I know about hacks, but yeah, videos. Thanks for checking them out. All right, bad start. Let's get back into it. Let's focus on to it. First up, we have an annoying defender, Nova. That should do some good damage. Yep. Dude, you're taking forever to die. Gee. 
these, man. been watching you guys since uncollected about five years ago wow dude that was like the first few videos i ever put up thank you man thank you for your dedication honestly <coughs> and those were the videos i just put them out you know just for fun to see like okay i didn't have any plan on doing like a youtube channel and doing it seriously i remember that was back in act five or something Thanks, man. Thanks for being there. Yeah, Noah is just a pain, honestly. If you don't have the right champion to deal with him, he's very painful. Do you know what? I have Human Torch. I'll just use Human Torch here. Oh, no. This is... Um, I forgot that this is... Biohazard. So I just have to use parry and heavy slowly. That's a bad pick. Spidey is going to give you some pain. Yeah, already he did. I think I just need to stick to mutant champions because I forgot there's biohazard as well. So, yeah. Hello, bro. Hey, buddy. How are you doing? Thanks for joining in. How's your day been like? To be, honest, to be honest, at this point, I'm just tired of this EQ. I just wanted to finish. So I can start focusing on other stuff like Karina challenges and, you know, all the good stuff. Uh, battlegrounds. Jeez, man. This dude sucks. Apocalypse use APOC? Yeah, I mean, that was the only champion left. Okay, his SPM is not really difficult to deal with. Seriously. Okay, he still dies. That biohazard caught me off guard too. Not bad, seeing a legend also make a mistake. Oh well. <laughs> yeah, of course I make a lot of mistakes. All the... How should I explain? All the videos that you see, they are like edited versions. I do a lot of testing on them before I put them out. So definitely I do some stuff like, you know, over and over again. Some of the parts, they will take me like 9, 10 tries to, you know, think about the right team. Or if I have to mention a champion in suggested champions, I have to run the path again. So a lot goes on on those videos that you guys don't see on the back end.
Man, Omega Red is just crazy. Jeez, man. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Doing the same path and this Nova is annoying. Dude, the whole path seems very annoying to deal with. <laughs> little bit late what did i miss nothing much buddy we are just doing our 1.2 exploration that we'll do 1.1 and then we will we'll be off to battlegrounds that's a lot of work yes it is a lot of work honestly so that's why you know the easy path videos that take a bit of time because a lot of other youtubers will just run the paths with you know the strongest champions that they have I have to work in a way where I have to think about making a video that is inclusive for everybody. Like, the champions, not everybody will have an Hercules, not everybody will have a Cosmic Ghost Rider, so yeah. Takes a bit before I can get to that part. So that's why I don't live stream it usually. I wait, I slowly start recording and then put up the easy path videos. I still have to finish the. 8.1 infographic. I'm almost done. I'm still working on it. So, yeah. Actually, I have quite a few content to catch up on. I used Cable as a horseman with wide max energy for the chapter mainly since I don't have a Mega Red to do Sauron. Man, I have white max. I just want to dupe him before I start, you know, building him up. Hopefully I can pull something from this featured crystal. I'm just saving up the crystals. I'll do like an opening at 20 of them. Noob, thanks. Your videos. I got Thronebreaker 2021 because of your guys. Congrats, man. Thanks for checking them out. I was really thinking to redo Axe 6 videos, all easy parts at least, with 2023 20, uh, updated guides. Because I think those guides are very outdated, so I was really thinking to do that. Would you guys be interested in that? But only easy parts. Do throw it already. Of course. She's gonna catch me at the tail end of it. I think that should be enough to kill her. Bye. Can you do an updated Suicide Master video? There's a very cool video by... I'm not sure the name of the YouTuber. Uh, I think it's UKM. UKM... <clears throat> UK has, uh, UKM has some amazing guides on mastery, so I would recommend to check him out, honestly. I think he recently did one guide as well. We do. There are always some new players who need help in X6. Yeah, because I was thinking if I do every single path, that will take a lot of time. Like that's 24 paths per like one chapter, and four chapter that'd be like around 80, 90, 100 videos. 
so instead of doing those what i can do i can do only easy path videos and uh, by 2023 like with updated champions I made excited for your guide in 8.2 when it's out in March. Thanks, buddy. I usually take like a couple of days off from work just to make sure, you know, in two days I can get at least all the easy parts out and then I start doing one by one the others. Do you throw your SV2? Alrighty, finally, that's path number one. Alrighty, let's use Apocalypse here and get our charges up. I nearly forgot about the poison, there is poison as well. Oh, I think this is power struggle node. I will only gain power when the defender has a bar of power. Your videos are greatly appreciated. I've seen your channel mentioned by a lot of people in MCOC social media pages. Thanks, man. When you say social media pages, is it Facebook or what are you mentioning? I'm on Twitter, so I know on Twitter, you know, people um, do refer my channel. But is that Facebook? Because I'm not on Facebook or any kind of channels there. Look at that damage at four chargers. Oops, messed it up there. Bye. Facebook and Twitter are MCOC pages. Right, so I know about Twitter. I don't have Facebook, so I need to, f you know, follow on Facebook as well. Because I can get some good feedback from there. I think feedback is very important to improve. So, yeah. There goes Black Cat. Oh man, I hate facing this guy. Quicksilver. 
I'm so bad against him. Oops. Got a little late on the SP1, but got it. Hey noob, I just finished 7.4.5. I'm on Superior Kang, who I've never fought before, okay? I have Human Torch. How many units do you think I should have for him? 745. Which one is that? Is that the one where he reverses time? I think that's the one, right? Now the problem with Human Torch there is that you can only use him once because he's only good if you have his Nova Flames. So I would suggest you use another champion to be honest. Who else have you got? Man, you gotta love Rogue, no? By the time she will finish her special attack animation, uh, animation the debuffs from APOC will be going down. Anyway, we got her. Hercules, CGR, Sunspot... Nick Fury Ghost Okay, uh, let me quickly finish this and then we will check out what boss it is and what strategy you should use. We will discuss that There she goes. Bye. CGR and her code smash Kang. You won't need too much units. A few revives are enough. Yeah, CGR will bypass. Uh, sorry, Herc will bypass everything on him, so you can just herc him down. Or for CGR, he has buffs also. He has debuffs also, so he should work. Alrighty, up to Juggernaut again, second time. Let's get this over with. Bye. Here he goes. Okay, seven, four, six. Let's look at the boss. Which boss you're talking about? Storybook two, seven, four. Okay, this dude. 
yep cgr should be really good here um your hercules will do a great job as well so yeah you can try both of them and they should work nicely good luck with that to be honest oops made a mistake Okay, this is the last path in 1.2. Hopefully we can finish all of these quicker and we can go into battlegrounds then. Oops, come on. Water. Okay, thanks. I'll grind some revives. Yes, you will need some of those revives. They will help a lot. Alrighty, Mangog is going to be next. armor break and bleed immune yep it's gonna be a painful fight Do you throw your SP2? Why are you so stingy? Should really stop freaking out on specials. Really? Do I freak out a lot? <laughs> That's a new one. <laughs> Not too bad, not too bad. Apocalypse just eats up everybody. Few more fights and then we are done. I'll be happy to be honest that Throne Breaker will finish. I know, it just feels like a chore doing it every month now. Oops, I think I'm dead. Okay. 
doing elp without her cookie tea is such a pain yes it is really really a pain because the first four champions is where you should just ease into it if you don't have a her cookie tea or even a cgr that would be bad new man united on second place out of nowhere they in the title race i don't think they're gonna win the title as much as i would love them to win the title i think they will finish like second or third this season they will win the uh, Carabao Cup and maybe the FA Cup as well. I'm not sure, but uh, yeah, Eric Ten Hag is doing a great job in Man United, to be honest. And I was one who was very skeptic when they, you know, hired him, and I was like, really, this guy? I don't even know the guy what he did. Especially when we were passing over Zinedine Zidane for him. Well, I suppose all of that worked out. Was that you against Legacy today in BGs? Yes, apparently I matched up against Legacy and it was live on stream and I got my ass kicked. I got a friend today, he sent me a text as well, like, you know, you were against Legacy. The dude stopped my promotion to Platinum 3. Like, okay. Wow. <laughs> I tried to dex, I got hit by one egg and I die. <laughs> Everyone around men, you do have games at hand. Yeah, they do have games at hand. So that's why I'm not really like, you know, thinking about United being like, you know, the winners. But I would love them to take at least one trophy. Especially the Carabao Cup as they are already in the final. And maybe if they can sneak in an FA Cup or something, that'd be great. But already what I'm seeing from Eric Ten Hag is just amazing. So yeah, after a long time, it feels like it's the Man United team. Like, you know, the fear factor going into Old Trafford. And uh, Rashford is just going on, on a mad one. Sup, noob? <laughs> All good, buddy. How about you? City are winning the league and FA Cup. Newcastle are winning Carabao. No chance. Man United is going to win one trophy for sure. Arsenal is going to win the Premier League. Yeah, Arsenal. I feel like Arsenal is going to win the Premier League. He's a tough guy, legacy, yeah, and a huge roster as well. That does help too. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> it 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 was all on the draft. My draft wasn't was the the best one. Oops. Wow, I did swipe back. I didn't get it. Man, you are one Rashford injury away from a massive collapse. Not really. Like, okay, kind of I agree on that. But there's Garnacho as well. You know, there is... The, I mean, uh, Vegos is there as well. So, there are some places where Man United is lacking. But I think they have enough players and... The most important thing, they are all working together as a team, so I'm sure they can win something.
Jeez, man. Finally, he's out. Hey, noob. Just wanted to thank you for all the content. Your videos have gotten me through so much content. Really appreciate all you do. Thank you, buddy. Thanks for checking them out. And thanks for you to hang around on the stream. Copying myself a Vago shirt if he scores 98 winner in any final we reach. <laughs> well, I don't think that he is a good enough like like good ev enough forward to stay at man united well let's see i mean harry ten hag is just doing amazing we weren't expecting that much for him anyway when he joined but it's great how he has turned around everything the club and people The way he handled Cristiano Ronaldo was crazy. <laughs> I'm not a MC fan, just hate MU. <laughs> yeah, that's how most people are. They just hate Man United for no reason. But it's been painful. The last, what, like seven, eight years have been really, really painful watching Man United struggle. Ten Hag did a great job at uh, at Ajax. I wasn't, I was never in doubt. So that's like, I was totally unaware of the guy. But the thing he did on the first loss, you know, the season started with a loss. I'm not sure what was the team against. He brought the team in, put them extra runs like 10 miles, and he ran with them. He ran the whole 10 miles with them, telling them it's you know they're all a team. I don't know what else would inspire leadership. And since then, all these uh, players have been listening to him. So it's just amazing how he has this man management skills. Alrighty, guys. 1.2 done. And final one. This is what skill champ science champions I think so only two parts here right good yeah this is science champions with the fatigue weakness exhaustion or fatigue champs okay so let's get First, let's get Magneto for the boss. And now, Science Champion we need with Fatigue, Weakness, and whatever it was. So, Weakness he can do. This guy can do Weakness. Um, Brighton? Yeah, it was against Brighton. Yeah, his man management has been immaculate. Dude, the, the balls it takes to go against Cristiano Ronaldo and the whole board and to tell, like, you know, this is going to be my team, my way. Otherwise, you can guys can go with, like, this is just amazing how he handled the team. Huge fan of him now. Okay, where is this dude and where is this dude? Okay. P 
people unsure about him because of how he treats Cristiano Ronaldo and all this. No more do people realize how good he is. Uh, yeah, he's just amazing. Ronaldo just, you know, the bigger you get, the more eager you have. And anyway, if, if you have to cultivate young minds or young people, you see it in universities all the time. You can, you know, how the classes are made and everything. If you want to cultivate young minds and teach them, then there should be only one senior or like the one boss who can give all the knowledge out and in that case it had to be Ten Hag, it can't be Ronaldo I don't know if that made sense whoops missing out those parries oh that's a good SP2 your SP2 okay I am dead six three thrashing two but he bounced back hard because he's a student of Pep and Bayern what do you expect yep it's just amazing to see all of these younger managers come up and uh, you know the older guard just you know like Sam Allardyce no more there uh, Alex Ferguson is not there uh, Rafa Benitez is not there anymore so all of these older managers you know just going out and making space for the younger ones it's just amazing to see why I'm missing parries I have no idea blocked very nice Hulk Ragnarok was my NPP for the entire thing okay I have him maybe I can bring him next dude she's so whippy in erections I'm dead who did you use on that Electro on the right path? Um, I think I used a Quake. Notice no one is talking about Ronaldo now. Yep. I think Ronaldo is way past his prime to be honest. I think, in my personal opinion, he should have retired after the World Cup from everything. He's made enough money and everything. He has a great legacy. It's just no point doing all of this. Well, I suppose, like, you know, he has other plans. Come on, Medusa die why are you being so mean finally she's out <laughs> no one except his sister yeah <laughs> that's true Ronaldo man, I love him, he just dug his own hole deeper, yep, he just messed up everything to be honest, like Man, that World Cup final was amazing, with uh, Mbappe was just crazy, the way they played bleeds man you gotta love that come 
one dude throw that SP? Finally. Wasn't it just off suit? And he goes down. Hey noob, I have Captain America Infinity War 6 star on the weekend. Is he worth taking up or no? Look, I'm very biased when it comes to Captain America Infinity War. I think he is one of the best champion of the game. And he's my absolute favorite. But having said that, there are plenty of other champions that can do alone what he does with synergies. So again, um, if you're like a fan fan of him, take him up. Otherwise, I don't think he's like the best investment. Maybe to a rank 3. If you really like him to a rank 4, but that's about it. Come on, dude. Why the AI is so passive, dude? Come on. Finally. Took me ages to get him to throw an SP2. Oops, missed it out. I have a rank 3 Anakin cap, I use him all the time, yes. Can use him on his own. Alden, hello, hey buddy, how you doing? Hussain, Habibi Noob, Kaif al Hal, Alhamdulillah man, all good, how about you? How is life treating you? We are just trying to finish off our Thronebreaker EQ. This is second to the last path. And then we'll be done with this. There we go, Immortal Abomination. Okay, we have a Warlock now. Let me just use Magneto and get rid of him. Come on, dude, not with the spite SP3. Oh. Oh, this is an annoying node. Okay, I'll throw it first, if you don't want to. <laughs> Hopefully it's enough. Uh, barely, yes, that's enough. <laughs> I like white for this chapter, keeps the power under control. Yeah, that would be a good one. I agree. Is it power only for this lane, or is it power throughout all of them?
All right, here comes another one, Hulk. Just curious, is there any champ you want but you did not get it yet? So for the longest, longest of time, I did not have uh, Kingpin. So I just got him the other day. So yeah, that is cool. Uh, I don't have a six star Domino. I would love to have a six star Domino because she's just all around amazing. And the recent champs in the um, featured, I have not yet opened any featured, so really looking forward to an absorbing man. So those are the champions I would like really, really want right now. God, he's poison immune. I should have just gone to an S3 for the acid wound damage. Come on, don't go to an SP3 now. Of course, he has to. There is a video somewhere about the rank 5 domino, you should check it out, it's insane, she's insanely good. Well, if you have the link, share it here on the chat and I will check it out with you guys. Alrighty, he's down. I'm not sure bro, I think this is the lane I used white for and I haven't touched the rest. <laughs> I mean we're almost there, we're almost done with the Thronebringer difficulty. Which honestly at this point feels like a chore, <laughs> like it's so much to do. There she goes. I think it's a KT1 video. Yeah, probably. He does those showcases for five rank five champions. So it might be for his video. Yeah, I agree. Okay, moving on to the boss. Let's get this done and over with. Yep, it's a chore. I always leave exploration till the last three days. Rather revive, revive, sorry, <laughs> revive, rather farm revives. Sorry, <laughs> my tongue got stuck there. Farm revives or play battlegrounds. Well, uh, depends how you look at it. For me, I want to clear all of this first, and then I just go into battlegrounds, so I don't have to worry about, you know, getting this stuff done. I mean, as much as it's annoying. It does give good rewards and right now I need all the shards I can get for the six star opening there we go However, six star, but I don't know how to use. I need to check out the video. Do you have Do you have a six star dupe? I wish I could have her like a six star dupe. I don't even have an undupe version of her. 
All right, guys, last path. Let's get this over with. Throne breaker done. Featured opening today. I have four featured crystals. I was thinking about saving them up for like a later video where I can open like 20 featured together. If you guys want to see some feature today, let me know in the chat. I've got. I'll have four after this, so maybe I can open one. He's so tanky, dude. <laughs> there we go. I just did this fight. Red Mag is so good. He's easy, but not the most fun to play. I think he's arguably the most essential champ. Or most useful after Hug. Well, quite a few of them. Like, I think Herc is in the same category. So is your Blade for Dimensional Beings. Your Human Torch for Mystic Champions. Apocalypse, I can argue for Skill Champions. There are quite a few champions in the game they are, like, must-have at this point. Well, Immortal Movinish is putting in the work. What's up, MCOC noob? I am good, Lionheart. How are you doing, man? Thanks for joining in. This month is basically Red Mag's month. If you have him, five out of six bosses are sorted. Yes, they are. It is a Red Mag month. Hey, noob, should I invest six in Herc, Nick Fury, or Ghost? Nick Fury needs only one six, so you don't need. Ghost can work without, so your best possible is Herc. You should go for Herc. Oops, 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 oops. Nice back driving percept. Mate, do you know if God is good after bus compared to other cosmic champions? Um, I mean, not compared to other Cosmic Champions, but he's better than how he was before. There are plenty of other Cosmic Champions that do way more than what he does. Alrighty, let's get that thing down with Captain Rank Infinity War. We should be good. Somebody explain to him that he needs to lose health as well, thing. Really? 
Really? Why did the unstoppable did not dispel? I had charges on me. See? Unstoppable is not dispelling. I need to check that. I give up. <laughs> I got two Daredevil white mags from the featured. Ah oh well, man. I really, really want this uh, Spidey. I don't really care about any other champion right now in that crystal. I just really want the Spidey. Come on, dude. Why is he so mad? <laughs> Got him. I want that Spidey also. Yeah, I think Spidey is amazing. And I want him for the last challenge as well. So there's that too. Almost there, guys. Almost there. Look at him melt, man. You gotta love Abomination. He's just mad amazing. I just said it to myself. I would refuse to buy the new feature. I will stick with basics. Jugs, long shot, hood in a row. Pretty happy with that. I mean, I'm going to go for these. Uh, I already have four, like, like, like three. I'll get one more from this exploration. And uh, I'm thinking to save up to like 20, 15, and then open the bowl together. Yo, big man noob and chat. Hey, buddy, thanks for joining in. How are you doing today? Oops, oops, oops. Come on, dude. Chill out. Who have folks used for the level 5 Rhino one shot? Uh, Juggernaut. First time I used Doom, but then Juggernaut was the best option. Makes it very easy. All right, guys, here we are, finally. Uh oh, boss remaining, and then we are good.
part of the reason I want I want the Spidey is because I still have to do the Karina challenge. So I want that Spidey. I'm even looking for the five star version of the Mystic Spidey. I'll be happy if I pull that. Oh, come on, dude. This should be enough. Can you open one featured? <laughs> okay, we'll open one featured. I've done four featured and got Wags, 66, Sinister, Overseer, Spidey Supreme, who's going... Oh, that's a good opening, man. That is an awesome opening. Alrighty, we are done for this month. There we go. Look at that. You gotta love these. I'm always out of them. I'm leveling up so much. 23,000. Good. And now we are at four crystals. Nice work, grads. Thanks, man. <laughs> it's crazy. It's been three days now. It took three days to get this done, but good, it's done. Hey, bro. Helping others is your best quality. Keep rocking always. Huge fan of your work, and my name is Costner Jack. Nice meeting you, buddy. And thank you for the kind words. Took down Hercules with Spidey. It took three revives. It can be a solo. Still learning him. Yep, he's going to be amazing. Okay, I'm just gonna open one, guys, just for the stream and see how do we end up. Okay, and then we will jump into battlegrounds. So only one. There we go. There's so many good champions, like. I won't be mad with any one of them. What do we get? What do we get? Oh, that was so damn close to the Spidey. That was so close. Oh, man. Okay, fine. I'll do it later. The remainings. Okay, so let's jump on to the battlegrounds now. What do you guys think? You want to see some battlegrounds? Finally, this is all done. I'll probably do Cavalier only easy path run. And yeah, that's it. We are done with the side uh, questing as well. We are all caught up. So finally, I can jump into Battlegrounds. Uh, 7.36 Kang, which path gives Fury for more damage? 7.36? Where is 7.36? Let's check it out, dude. 7. Three, six. 
Paradox. Damn, it's been so long we did this Kang. Uh, Neurokinetic Paradox Fury. What does this say? Yeah, I think it's this one to be honest. The one with Punisher uh, 2099. Each paradox and attack rate grants them indefinite fury, increasing attack rating by 8%. Yes, that's the same one. That's the path. The one with the uh, Punisher 2099. With safeguard on it. Yep, that's the one. Hey, Dab, how you doing, buddy? How's everything? I'm sure you're already in uh, Gladiator Circuit. Alrighty, let's jump into it. Let's get our ass handed to us a little bit more. <laughs> there we go. My pleasure, mate. Yep, I got there yesterday. <laughs> Very humble, buddy. <laughs> I'm still struggling in gold one. I haven't played much, to be honest, but yeah. Alrighty. So, I think he's running suicides. Not giving void, not giving this guy. The rest is okay. There's a kitty and there is a domino as well. I think I'll probably remove domino. Yep. Oh, he banned my king <laughs> kingpin straight away. Alrighty. Uh, one or two. Let's start with these. One thing I did, I just equipped all of my champions with all the relics I had. So hopefully that's going to help us. Kingpin, uh, Nick Fury, okay. That's not suicides, really? Like, he has unusually high... Uh, PI on the champions. But let's see, let's see. This guy has a rank 5 torch. Ooh, okay. That was a rank 5 torch. Uh, what else? What else we've got here? Um, it doesn't have a good counter for the Korg, so let's put a Korg. Of course he gets a bishop. <laughs> I think he's just max sig. Ah, uh, okay. Coolios. Should be good. Korg, okay. 
If I give him Korg, who is going to use? Okay, let's go Korg versus Korg. Bishop versus Bishop? <laughs> you know what? Why not? Let's do it. <laughs> let's do like a mirror match. I'm so bad with Bishop, I don't even know how this guy works. I know who I was waiting for for so long to throw that SP2. so close <laughs> just parry and build up to an sp2 oh well i thought i got really late on that but we made it all right all right uh let's throw a nick fury at him yeah doesn't have a good counter for Nick Fury. I mean, he can play good if he uses uh, Shang-Chi. Okay, let's go with <coughs> Elsa. Man, Elsa has just been crazy in this meta. Bye! <laughs> Easy win for Elsa. Yeah, Elsa is just, I love her. I just put up a video yesterday with some random, uh, you know, takedowns. I just... Um... So yeah, that was fun to do. I just labeled her Queen Elsa's Dominion. <laughs> I just put a video up just for that. So yeah. Greetings. Have a nice broadcast. Take it easy, noob. Thank you, buddy. Thank you so much. For Elsa, you want to do light enter basic combos and SP1 spam. Ah, all right. What I usually do is I go for SP1 into SP2. So that helps. But yeah, I, I see what you mean there. If I go with light enders, that will give um, that will give the armor breaks and the SP1s will give the incinerates. So yeah, that should totally work. That was quick. I still don't have an Elsa. Yeah, Elsa is amazing, dude. I'm really considering taking her to rank 4. 
All right, that's the first win of the day. I took the wrong path in 2.2 EQ. I'm stuck at 99 completion waiting for energy. <laughs> oh man, I feel for you. Yeah, if you end with light, it applies busted. Yeah, so your critical deals more worse damage. Right, got it. See, you learn something new every day. Thank you, guys. So, light attack ender with uh, SP1 spam. Got it. Oh, come on. I'm trying to press accept because, but it's not going through. Did my game got stuck? Yeah, I think it's stuck now. <laughs> I have to restart. Immortal Hulk, he is amazing. Like, his gameplay is a little you need to learn, but he is amazing. The amount of damage he can put out is just mad. Okay, back to battlegrounds. Sorry about that, guys. Here we go. Responsible battle realm citizen. <laughs> That's a nice one. Okay, so Human Torch is a definite ban for me. Uh, the rest, uh, I'm this dude I don't want to face. I mean, I have him too at high sig, but still, he's annoying. Who else he's got? I don't want to face this guy. Okay, I'm good. Does Absorbing Man need to be duped? Yeah, I think he needs to be duped. Okay, hold on. What happened here? Okay. This guy can deal with both. And for Domino... Let's... Yeah. So we have somebody to deal with Gore, and I also have to deal with, uh, yeah. So far, we are good. Okay, Kingpin. Ooh, the problem will be Doom. Doom will be an issue. Let's grab a Magneto then. I'm not getting any defenders, man. <laughs> it's gonna bite me in the butt later. Like, I've got zero defenders. <laughs> okay, I'm not complaining on Bishop. Bishop is fine. Of course, Sasquatch was gonna come out. And I'm thinking, like, who's, like, the best possible chance against Sasquatch? So who should we go against Sasquatch, guys? Sasquatch. Hmm. Beat him 
there. Yeah. I'll go with the crossbones and see what happens. I mean, he's quite tanky. Oh, he's running suicides, okay. to be careful with my furies it will fuel his uh, mystic dispersion also should be dead yep S suicides in BG strange yeah that's very strange to be honest I was kind of worried that there might not be enough damage damage from crossbones, but the stupid side helped me a lot. Okay, what should we throw at him now? Um, okay, let's give him a Omega Sentinel. He has a domino to throw at me. I didn't notice that. Okay. At least she's not duped. Uh. Let me try a Hyperion. That was a bad draft from my end. for an SP2 here. That wasn't too bad. Got it. I am looking for my third rank 4 to become Paragon. I did Superior Kang two weeks ago. Thanks again for that noob. After I understand the fight was actually super fun. Really enjoyed it. Yeah, that's I, what I love about uh, Kabam. How they define, how they make the fights is once you get, once you understand the fight, it becomes like very enjoyable. You enjoy all the small little intricacies they have in the fights. Alrighty guys, two out of two. Hopefully we can get one more and we can get into platinum finally. I think I will be dropping a video with some Shang-Chi takedowns this season. I'm just dropping out random videos on uh, Battlegrounds. I just record my fights and just put them out like one particular champion with different defenders. So yeah. Okay, so you need to take out first. 
Evil Torch, Void, because I don't want to face them. And Rintra, because he is one tanky idiot. And we are good. Splits, uh, split stream rotation was super helpful. Oh, I remember now. That one. Yeah, that 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 uh, simplifies the fight quite a bit, to be honest. Okay, this and this lady. Gara, how are you doing, buddy? I am very good, man. Thanks for joining in. Hey man, beat Superior Kang two weeks ago and explored 8.100% to get the rank 4 maths. Okay, what do we have here now? There is a Gallon and there is that guy. So this guy could be a good defender here. And this guy could be a good defender. You know what, let me just grab this one. And became Paragon. All thanks to you. Chose Herc, Scorpion, and Fury as my first rank force. Congrats, man. Those are some amazing rank ups. Well played, man. GG's. Okay. So we have a Nick Fury, and we have a. So he can handle. Yeah, and this guy can handle Nick Fury. I mean, his defense is not really intimidating at this point. I've got counters to most. Domino, I already have Omega Sentinel. And I can start off with the Doom, and I still have an Ebony Maw. So you probably go for a Scorpion. Yep. Bishop. Alrighty. Should we grab a bishop here? Uh, yes, bishop, bishop, bishop. Yeah, bishop is the right option. Thanks for your guidance, Yossi Noob. Helps me a lot because you, I have done X678. Congrats, man. Congrats. That makes me very happy. <laughs> Battlegrounds is a lot of fun to watch. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So let's give him a Doom. To start off with. You know what? Let's give him an Ebony Maw. I mean, he can Kingpin him. But let's see. Who's going for Scorpion? Nick Fury. Uh, okay. Nick Fury, Nick Fury. Should we go with... I'll just go Apocalypse. Hey Jules, how are you doing buddy? Open 7 features god, absorbing man thrice, that is awesome man. Great luck. I don't think that was the best pick, to be honest. <laughs> it will take ages to kill. I'm still doing the first life. 
This is gonna suck. Let me just <laughs> one percent. Oh wow, Ebony Ma, dude, he held up really, really well. <laughs> okay, where's the chat? It's eight p.m. in Singapore. Oh, righty, you're from Singapore. By the way, Bishop and Herc are amazing for eight point one boss. They took all the phases down with their SP1, with their one SP2. Use G299 for the last phase. Awesome, man. Good to know. Don't let him get to the second life. Well, that's what I did. <laughs> Yeah, I usually put him as a defender. I don't use him as an attacker. Apocalypse, but this time around, just used him. But hey, we got the win. We're okay. That's a slow build up. Okay, throw your SP1, dude. Don't be mean. That's it. That's it. <laughs> Bye. He's dead. Oh, man. Thank you for the promotion, dude. <laughs> 5 30 p.m. India. Alrighty, it's 4 p.m. in Dubai right now. Would have lost if the second life would have started. Yes, that was so close. 12 <laughs> 2 p.m. here in the UK. Nice. Okay, I'm seriously new. I think I'm going to try and go back to sleep. But I'm glad I could catch you live. Take it easy, okay? Thanks, man. Thanks for joining in. Really appreciate it. You have a good one, man. Bye, chat. Bye. <laughs> what is safeguard node? Uh, the defenders cannot lose more than a percent of age of HP. So I would say use your champions that are uh, that are damaged over time. So for example, for that Punisher 2099, he's a metal champion. You can use uh, Magneto. The bleeds will kill him off easy. This meta is much enjoying than the previous. Yes, it's 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 an easier one. Last meta was really really a difficult one. Like you need to really understand and have the right champion. This this meta is more of a, this meta is more of how should I say more nuke nuke meta. Oh, 
Okay, we moved up to platinum, guys. That was cool. Okay. Let's try and find it with an elder mark and see how that goes. Please suggest a defender to upgrade mutant Emma Frost, Havoc, or Mr. Sinister. Havoc. Yes, Havoc is the best one. Let's go platinum. Yes. <laughs> Nimrod was my worst nightmare last meta. He still actually is though. Ah, Nimrod, I got him down, man. Okay, so he doesn't have a... Oh, he has. Okay. Void also. Now I need to remove one more. What he's got, what he's got. Absorbing man. That's okay. Sorry about that, guys. Just got a call. Uh, okay. Okay, um, can't we use champions with no dot? I mean, lance you can use them, but you know, uh, it will be painful. The best option will be to use champions with damage over time, so they will make short work of him. I think so far I'm happy with the draft. Let's see. Okay, I've got an Elsa and I've also got um, so Elsa. That's an attacker. I've got one, two, three defenders. Uh, okay. I mean, I could use a Shang Chi if I needed to. No, it's better Warlock. Those dudes got bishop and yeah. Now he still hasn't got a mystic. He has no answer to our Hulkling, so that could be our first defender. And also, I don't think he has an answer to this guy. Okay, I think we've got enough defense and offense. Okay. Because for Spider Gwen, I've only Chi and Odin, they don't have Dot. Honestly, bro, I have to go back and check again. I'm not really sure about the whole path. I have to go back, check again, and then I can, you know, tell like, okay, what can be used. Alrighty, so we need to make sure that we alternate his special attacks.
Ooh, that was close. <laughs> Oh, the region is killing me. Can you die already, bro? Oh, now he's unblockable. Ah! Dude took the piss, didn't die? I mean, we're still okay, but that was crazy. <laughs> Best skill player in MCUC right now? Um, Suida, Fintech. So I would say Sweda, Fintech, MSD. There are a couple of more players I know from the chat. Biroman. Like these guys are just crazy. Downright crazy. Good morning, Broski. Hey buddy, how you doing? Hyperfrost, hey buddy, how's it going? Alrighty, Omega Central did good. Did you explore the Thronebreaker quest? Yes, I've done exploring the Thronebreaker quest. Hey noob, how you doing? I am very good, Manny. Thanks for joining in. How's been your day? That's another win. I explored full throne breaker quest yesterday. Now I'm doing a completion run of Cavalier. Yeah, I would do the same honestly. I'll, fi I'll finish the full run for throne breaker and then I will go for a Cavalier as well. Posted? Yes, all of them are posted. Actually, this is uh, on this stream. I just finished the Throne Breaker for 1.1 and 1.2 chapter. So once we finish the stream, it will be up there. I will also put the timestamps so you guys can check it out. So here is how how it works, guys. If I win this, I will do another one more, one more uh, battle grounds to try and get into Platinum 2. But if we lose here, then that's it. We'll end the stream right there. Okay, what should I remove?
My pleasure, man. Uh, should I rank up my AA to rank 3 unawakened? Yes, definitely. AA deserves all the ranks, even unawakened. Okay, Shang-Chi and... Uh, right. We already have a Shang-Chi. So this dude and this dude. Defense and two offense champions right now. Guys, does uh, long shot work against Rintra? I was fighting you not long ago. You wrecked me. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Thanks for joining. It's okay. We all ha all have those days. I got wrecked by Legacy today live on stream, so yeah, that was embarrassing. <laughs> I was just joking, <laughs> all fun and games. Uh, okay, I still don't have a tech champion. Okay. No, Nimrod is better. If he goes for a kitty, Nimrod I already have there, so yeah, that should work. I still need more attacking champions though. It's a very close draft. It should work because he is not instant immune, but he is beefy. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking about. Just slowly eat him away. Well, let's see. I don't have the best draft. This is going to be like a close fight. Okay, I am going first. Alright. Let me give an Ebony more to start with. I think he'll probably go Mr. Negative on the attack. Doom. Doom, 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 doom. I don't think I have a counter to it. Okay, let's try Shang-Chi then. Ooh, and that's a rank 4 doom as well. What am I doing? Just prolong the fight for no reason. I could have done this 10 seconds ago. Why well, we still got the win? Always hate facing Doom. Doom is such a good defender. This uh, meta, if you are not... Um, if you ban out Human Torch, Doom is so good.
Okay, who should I give it to him now to deal with? Oh, Doom, Doom, let's give him a Doom. Doom, Shang-Chi. And I think I can go with the Hulkling on Nimrod. Yep. Shuri is good for defense in AWVG. Um, I'm not really sure, man. I mean, she's a new champion and she's quite annoying. You cannot parry her. So yeah, probably she would work. Most of the champions will not be able to parry her. So, yeah. Alrighty, that's another win. Do you think Mentis is good for this meta because she can cleanse these buff using SP1? Uh, depends how much of you have. Uh, the, the champions that really work are the ones that have easy access to cleanse or they have easy access to uh, like removal, debuff removal. So your Kingpin, your Jabari Panther. Uh, champions like these will work really well. If you have to wait for a special one, it might, might not be that good, but you can always try. Alright guys, this is going to be the last match. We will try to get the promotion. To platinum two. If not, then that's it. That's let's call it a day here. Hello noob. I can't evade some opponent specials like Korg and Iron Man Immortal. Uh, all I can say is just practice, man. The more you practice, the more you will get to know it. And who is Iron Man Immortal? Oh, stacked roster, dude. Stacked roster. That's a really stacked roster. Thanks for sharing this dude. I came back to the game recently after two years. Most of my roster is ranked to equivalent. Not sure if I sh should be attempting Throne Breaker Exploration. Done completion already. I would say try to do Cavalier and then come back for Throne Breaker if you want to try. Okay, what's happening here? So we need a Doom as a defender, but I need an attacker as well. Uh, okay. I'm confused with Jabari and Hitmonkey who should go rank 4 first. Well, depending on you, I would do Jabari. I mean, both are good. You can't go wrong with both of them. Hitmonkey has a lot of crits. Jabari has cri uh, has bleeds and also cleanse. I would do Jabari first, to be honest. Okay. So far, we have a counter to everything. We still need a counter to that Doom. That Doom is going to be annoying to deal with. Uh, he doesn't have a counter to this guy. Yeah, let's put him out.
and famous Iron Man. Okay, got it, got it. I was wondering who's who's like immortal Iron Man. Okay. Let's try Mr. Fantastic. If we can bait out his kingpin, we should be able to get through this. Okay. Now I don't see an obvious counter of Doom with him. Okay, he's thrown a gallon our way. Um, let me go for a crossbones. Yeah, that makes sense. I have a Jabari 6 star now, taking her to rank 2. I recently duped her and I will be taking her to a rank 3. She truly deserves it. And she's amazing for this meta for victory track 2. Oh jeez. That harvest. You gotta hate it. Why is it so trigger happy today? Oh well, that was sad. Oh, looks like he's gonna win the first round. Okay. Second round, we will throw... Yeah, let's give him a man thing to deal with. I think he's gonna probably throw a doom our way. Yep. Don't have a good counter, so I'll go with the kingpin. Uh, looks like a loss, but let's let's try it.
we tried guys we did try that was so close <laughs> All right, GG's. Alrighty guys, I think that would be it for today. Uh, still on Platinum 3, we tried to get up in Platinum uh, 2. But we won or lost the last match, that would have given us a promotion. So I think from tomorrow onwards I will just do battleground streams the usual because the throne breaker is done. So yeah, uh, hang around guys tomorrow as well in the stream. I really appreciate you guys being here, and I will leave the timestamps in this stream if you guys want to check the exploration for 1.1 and 1.2. Rest on the channel as well. So I hope you all have an amazing evening, or well, at least it's evening for me wherever you are in what part of the world. And I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.